Shale and today I'm going to show you how to install simple X-ray mode along with Optifine, the non-forge version. If you already have the Optifine installed with non-forge, like you didn't install with, with forge just using the installer that Optifine provides, you may skip uh, to the uh, later part of this video. I will have an annotation here, like here, uh, that will let you skip to the installation of X-ray mod. But uh, for those that don't have Optifine installed, we will start with that right now. So the first thing you need to do to install Optifine uh, is to get this file from this side. And I will link this in the description so that you don't have to search for it. Uh, and basically the file that's uh, that's interesting for us right now, the only one, uh, is the Minecraft 1.7.10 uh, Optifine here. This one, there's only one file right now, as of this date. Uh, and the only thing you need to do is hit download here and it will direct you to AdFly. Uh, you have to wait 5 seconds for that and then skip the AdFly and then you will be redirected to another site where there's uh, a download link. It will download instantly. The file is really small, so it should take about 15 seconds to download. So now that you have it, uh, you may enter your roaming and actually make it smaller and find your .minecraft folder. And it's really important that you have it already, uh, so you need to play the game at least once. Uh, it's really a good thing to copy your .minecraft folder somewhere, like on your desktop or a special folder that you have for it, before you start doing any changes, uh, because they may ruin the game and you'd have to um, do everything from the beginning. And if you save it, you just need to switch the folders and everything will be fine. Alright, so let's enter the .minecraft folder. Uh, and here I've already pre played... Uh, Minecraft 1.7.10 here, and I already have Forge installed. And we could probably install, <laughs> I mean, not probably, uh, for sure we could install Optifine with Forge, uh, the way normal mods are installed, so Optifine would go here, into the mods folder, um, but we, we really want to have uh, the Optifine version, like here will be a separate folder with Optifine, so that we will be able to install Simple X-Ray the easiest way possible. Alright, so what we need to do now is just double click the Optifine file and it will only work if there's a little <laughs> little Java icon here. If your file doesn't look like this, you need to right click it and choose Open With and Java Platform. Alright, so double click it and a little window pops up and here, uh, here it states this installer will install Optifine so of course we hit install and Optifine is successfully installed without Forge as you can see there's a new folder here in the versions folder uh, we may enter it right now and as you can see there are two files and the Forge version is still here it's all fine and, and when we enter the Minecraft uh, launcher, and it, it works the same on the Cracked Knet launcher as well. Alright, and I've logged in. And as, as you can see, we can now choose from profiles, Forge, Optifine, and the vanilla one that's called Shale, for a reason. Uh, and as you can see, it's ready to update and play Minecraft with Optifine. Alright, so let's turn it off now and let's get to installing Simple X-Ray. So now that we've installed Optifine, we may start installing Simple X-Ray. And for that we will need this file from this side. I will link it in the description of course, this is a Minecraft fo forum topic uh, where the creator has put the download links. Uh, and the download links are here, it's really easy to find them. Uh, it doesn't matter which one you choose, uh, they are both for the current version, that is Minecraft 1.7.10. Uh, 
and you may uh, click any link you want to. Uh, both will direct you to an AdFly site and then you will have to wait 5 seconds to skip it. Uh, and then of course download the mod from Mediafire on Se or Sendspace depending on which, which link you've chosen. Alright, so now that you have the, the file sitting in your desktop, here comes the hard part. Alright, so let's enter roaming and the dot minecraft uh, folder and of course again <laughs> try to copy this folder somewhere so in case anything goes wrong you will have a safe copy uh, that you may just return to your folder to your roaming folder all right and let's enter and let's find the optifine version and here the only file that that concerns us uh, is the jar file not the JSON file and the jar file we need to open with WinRAR or any other archivizer you're using. Let's make it like this and now that we have this one open we need to open simple x-ray using the same meth method that is with WinRAR or any other file uh, archivizer you're using and what we need to do now is copy all the files from this folder to this folder so let's just uh, select them uh, in case you're worried that there are any invisible files here you may just hit ctrl and a to select everything and now just drag them to this folder hit ok and they are copied here. So we may close this one and all the files are copied here right now and what we need to do now is delay the meta inf uh, folder so just hit shift and delete and yes I am sure I want to delete this. Alright so we may close this and now we have the modified Optifine uh, folder here and we may enter Minecraft And we of course need to choose the Optifine profile so that our simple x-ray will be there and we may hit play. I'm not speaking anything right now because I'm waiting for the game to load. And it's taking awfully long. Alright, so let's enter a single player word, let's create a new one, it can be a new word. And it's still taking forever. My computer is overheating, you can't probably hear it, but... And as you can see, now our coordinates are showing. Uh, and that's due to the x-ray being installed and actually if you hit escape right now you will have the x-ray settings here and the x-ray settings uh, well we have to make the window a little bit larger so that we'll be able to read it properly all right that's almost it Uh, you may read all of this later if you want to, it's always there, uh, you can always read it, but what's, in, what's interesting uh, the most uh, are the keys here. So press B while playing to for Fulbright, press, press V while playing for Cave Finder, uh, N for coordinates in the top corner, so these ones, and X for X-ray. So let's hit X right now and of course it doesn't work on snow and as you can see the x-ray is working but everything is really really dark so let's hit B for full bright it's still not as bright as we'd like it to but we can see something at least <laughs> I don't know if I'm jumping on or so on something or if I'm 
just stuck somewhere. Since we have Optifine installed, we may just zoom in on anything. Alright, let's turn X-Ray off. And if you turn it on again, it's still in full bright mode. Uh, you can turn off the full bright mode with B. And yeah, that's about it when it comes to X-Ray, uh, a simple X-Ray with Optifine. Uh, I hope everything is clear now, but if you still have any questions, uh, just ask me in the comment section below or write a private message and I will try to answer them uh, the best way I can. Uh, and thank you for watching and see you in the next tutorial. Bye!